Okay, dear students. So in this question, a spring of negligible mass and the length L naught hangs from a fixed point. Hangs from a fixed point. So the original length is given as L naught. When the mass small m is attached to it, to the free end, the length of the spring increases to capital L. So now the new length that comes out to be is L. Okay, so earlier it was L naught. Okay, this is the extension. The tension in the spring is equal to K delta X. So that is the restoring force that is given by the spring K delta X as usual, where K is a constant spring constant and delta X is the extension in the spring. What is the true value of K? I will say, okay, fine. So at this position, the extreme position that we have uh, uh, suspended a mass M on the spring and now the spring, uh, it has achieved another position. So at this position, there are two forces, the weight Mg and the upward force will be equal to K delta X as given in the question. So we can very well say that K delta X will be equal to Mg. Usually this thing happens. Always think from that point of view, there is a translatory equilibrium here. Neither the block is moving downwards, nor the block is going up. Although the block is being acted downwards by weight and block is being pushed, uh, pulled upward by the spring. But even then the block is not moving in either direction. So it means both of the forces are equal and opposite. So Mg is equal to K delta X. What is the true value of delta X now? It can be taken as L minus L naught is equal to mg. Hence, k is equal to mg divided by L minus L0. So from there, we get C as the right answer. Let us verify that from the mark scheme. And yes, the answer is C. So with this, all the best. Bye.